Brought to you by Pentec International, a proud Nate Star member. Hello and welcome to Pentec's Tension Meter instructional video. Getting started is simple. Open the Tension Meter's hard case, which comes standard with purchase of any Tension Meter model. In order to use the Tension Meter, we'll need to know the exact size of the cable we'll be working on. We'll be using a Pentec laser etched cable gauge with cable color code, which comes optional with purchase of Tension Meter. Just fit the gauge slot on the cable until you get a snug fit without any wiggle room. The cable gauge slots work for most quarter inch to one inch galvanized steel strand and bridge strand cables. Once the cable size is confirmed, we must refer to the tension meter calibration charts for proper block size and handle position. Remember, each tension meter is one of a kind. Calibration charts are specifically created for each and every individual tension meter. The saddle box should be secured to the tension meter using a 7 16 wrench. Here are some examples of things to avoid when taking tension meter readings. When taking readings, dial face should always face the user and must always be on the lower side of the cable. Avoiding contact with PLPs ensures accurate tension readings. Users should always be aware of ground hardware, cable damage, overgrown vegetation, or anything on the cable that could block full contact between tension meter and cable. Any obstructions can result in inaccurate tension readings. Proper tension meter hanging. Finding an undamaged spot on the cable, the user slips the tension meter hook on the cable. The user then pushes the lever in one fluent motion to the proper handle position. When reading the dial, it is recommended the user not look at the dial from an angle, but straight on. With the dial on the lower side of the cable and the dial face towards the user. Our first reading is 39. Cable tensions change depending on weather and temperature, so taking ambient or cable surface readings are important when aligning and tensioning towers. While moving meter to different spots on the cable, the user should take an average of three similar readings per guide cable. Using the tension meter calibration charts, the user can translate dial tension readings into pounds. In this scenario, our dial read 39, Using our charts, it translates to 3,500 pounds of tension. A standard tension meter model TM1000 is sold with 15 EHS cable calibration or a 22 cable EHS and bridge strand cable calibration. The TM1000 can be calibrated for an unlimited amount of cables that fit within 3 sixteenths to 1 inch hook diameter. Pentec tension meters can be calibrated for different types of cables including, but not limited to, Philly strand, wire rope, alumina weld, bridge strand, Kevlar rope, and so on. The calibration charts display the tension meter calibration date. Owners are recommended to send meters back for yearly certification. Pentec Tension Meters. When you need the best, forget the rest.